What's going on guys, your boy Turbot Reacts here, back with another one of these. Ping Pong the Animation is back on the channel and today I'm going to give you three episodes to finish up this series and then I'm going to try to see if I can sum things up for you in a beautiful review of this series and what I think about it and the lessons that we can learn from this anime so greatly portraying so many life lessons in a, such a small amount of episodes which is pretty cool we got 11 episodes we got three more episodes we'll be done so i'm gonna finish those up today and hopefully get these out to you guys tomorrow okay so or i might just release it late tonight who knows whenever it's done who knows anyways man it's cool it's awesome this anime is one of those things that a lot of things to grasp from this and i think i'd probably need to watch it over again to truly understand everything and grasp everything of what the author or the writers of the show was trying to portray to really grasp everything because you're not going to get everything in the first go around unless you're calling yourself a genius which you're probably not <laughs> Okay, so I don't pretend to know everything because I don't. <laughs> so I just know that I pick up on things very quickly. And I don't catch everything. When it comes on to TV shows and anime, I'm just not going to catch everything. And um, that's just how it is. That's just what it's going to be. And, you know, I don't claim to be a genius. I know my strengths and I know my weaknesses. Okay, so the thing about it is this anime portrays growth and you know life's skills and persistence and giving up coming back all of the that good stuff inspiration you know talent plus hard work what it can create and yes i did notice that he's the robot hero peko i did notice that just didn't mention it in my review okay i just didn't mention it in my review yes i did notice that it was him i i did notice when mr smile called said welcome back hero i saw all of that stuff man i just didn't mention it in my review you guys gonna understand i'm doing my reviews directly after i watch the episodes so a lot of stuff maybe i'm not going to remember especially the fact that i watched two episodes back to back so i might not remember certain things that happened during the episode at the time um so i'm just not gonna catch everything either as i said before so if you're going to correct me in the comment section about something that i missed or said do it in a constructive way please don't be mad because i missed something um, because this is how it is. I'm just going to miss some things. I'm, I'm human. I'm not a super genius like you are, you know, like this is how it is, man. You know, I'm, I'm a regular dude. I'm a regular dude that has, yeah, let, let me not go there. <laughs> Anyways, great story so far, man. Great story so far. I love the fact that Peko is back. He got back, beat Kong. It's just Kong. It, Kong's character is is a very interesting character. He's very interesting because he also has great character development in the series when it comes on to um he came back with even he came back even better for this pre inter high like it's like an invitational so it's like you got to do this and the top people qualify for for inter high, right? So he came back with, with with a better spin on the ball. And he faced Peko, and Peko is just on another level. Now, this story is not based around just one character. Like, I can't say Mr. Smile is the protagonist. You know what I'm saying? Of the story. Yes, it started out that way. Seem was going in that direction, but we quickly learn that it's about Kazuma, it's about Kong, it's about Peko, it's about Mr. Smile, 
It's about the coaches. It's about... There's so many different people that have character development in this series that you can't say any of them are quote-unquote side characters. They're all essential to the story. So you have to pay attention to everybody's dialogue. Um, you know, so especially the characters that are really featured. Even, what's his name, Sakuma? I think it was the guy that pep talk Peko back into the game. Um, I love the fact that Peko is putting in that work because now he can basically be unbelievable. Him and Mr. Smile can be untouchable. They can be on Kazuma's level, uh, if not even surpass him. You get what I'm saying? So right now is yet to see. I still want to see Mr. Smile go up against the dude this the the um the second best from Kyle right uh, I don't know what I don't remember what they call him like the vice president or I don't know but vice captain yeah vice captain that's what they call him um so I do want to see that matchup if it does happen it should happen because they say that the only person that's standing in his way to get to the finals is that dude I don't know his name don't ask me whatever so we're gonna jump into these episodes man three episodes see how they turn out what's good what's not you know good times all right so i'll see you guys for the review so make sure you check out these three episodes i will be uploading them to youtube so you're gonna have three places to watch you can watch the full reactions on youtube right you can watch the full reactions on youtube and bitch and no not youtube Google Drive and BitChute, full reaction, okay, full reactions, on YouTube, I'm gonna cut it up, try to cut it down as much as possible, for like 10 minutes, 10 minutes of each episode, I'll be uploading them separately, not in the same video, okay, so, just look out for that, okay, so, thank you guys so much for tuning in, and I will see you guys later, for the review, of course, make sure you leave a like before you leave. <laughs> Ha <laughs> ha. Hey, yeah, Charlie, I ran you by late on. Now the trauma got your go. Not a why. You show your young, touch your tarts, hey, yes, ma. Ah, who should was sure that I don't show. Nega, she was told the Shilia, she didn't ya, why? Can't you lie? 连伤感的功夫都没有啊！嗯，やべえ、見つかっちゃったよ、おい。頭出すぎなんだよ、バカ。泣けた、ウェンガ。泣くか。还得教那帮迷途的小小鸟们怎么回家呢。カザマがおらんの。あ、うっ。見るに値戦試合中古とかいの。おい。What match？ 監督、一つ聞いてよかですか？うん、今試合はもし自分が取り寄ったら、やつもちったわしらんごと見直してくれますかね。余計なことは考えるな。試合に集中しろ、サナダ。よし。九番高等、三回戦、片手高校、月本選手、海洋学園、サナダ選手。はいはいはいはいはいはいはい。シャー強いのかい、あの眉毛。強いよ、母ちゃん。風間のおかげで今一つ影が薄いが、去年のインハイではベスト4、全日本でもベスト16に入ったモンスターだ。ダーンモンスターね。ノープロノープロ、スマイルは負けねえさ。ペコどこ行ってやがった探したぞ、随分。うんこ。下品<笑>お疲れさん。なんの吹っ飛ばせ、スマイルぶちかましたねそれでどうなんだい膝は持ちそうかい俺たちがついてるぞあいにくこの目は節穴と違ううん。サンキューパパ。心配ねえわ。うん。あ、見た見たこっちだおーいスマイルおーいギブンサムレギュレーションアクション Yeah.
<笑>うーん。さすがのおじさまもバンジーキュースかね。うーん。監督や風間が買いかぶりよるけ随分多くしちゃったな。ふたけだしょうせん。片子おば。さ、一本。さ、さ。まずいな。見らんねえ風間わしが勝つまい悲惨な惚れちょる婚男にわしが勝つまいアウト 2-9 ウィッツバレとかポケットに弾を集中されるとサナダは脆い英国無慈悲だわかるか道よそいつが住まえるモンスターの力だよ今まで試しよったとかわしんことたまちらせてうちよったんはそんためかこんかけ<笑> <笑>行きますロバットアクティベイテッショ叩けと叩けと攻撃性格に拾われとって一向になっちゃうレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドスウェットレッドス
いつも一人で親父から買ってもらったっていうゲームばっかやってやがったけど卓球教えてやったらえれえ笑ったんよ僕もペコみたいになれるかな、wow. 僕ペコみたいになりたいんだペコみたいにけど田村で写真見るまですっかり忘れてた笑わないからスマイルじゃなくて卓球やってる時笑ってたからスマイルって呼んだんだ、really? so、ピンチの時にはオイラを呼びな、yeah. そうすりゃオイラがやってくるあいつはもうずっと長いこと俺を待っているずっと長いこと俺を信じているあいつが笑わんくなったんはオイラの卓球がしょっぱくなってたから、wow. 気がついてたけど知らんふりしてたビビって必死に耳塞いでたさ Like、the big man is waiting so we can smile そろそろ together again on this court, man. Let's get it. Michio san, racket to Credo. So no money. More p i g g d e k k a i j t a i j i s h i n a k a y Peko, smile no tameni, u t u n o k a i j i g e o b a b a Oida ga hero da kara shaw. そこんとこよろしく愛してるぜペコ心の中で3回唱えろヒーローケンザンヒーローケンザンヒーローケンザンそうすりゃオイラがやってくるちょっとどうしてください選手が出ますピンポン星からやってくるシャー That is so dope The ending of this episode is so dope, guys. Like, I can't even tell you how much I love the ending to that because it just goes to show you, like, it brings back their friendship and it just goes, it's just like, why the hell, you know what I'm saying? This whole Mr. Smile thing and Peko is bringing it back into perspective and, and letting us, the audience, know now that the reason why I call him Mr. Smile. Is because he smiled when I introduced him to table tennis. It was good times, we were friends, and whatever. And it's obviously like that sentence where Sukimoto was what he was basically saying that, um, basically saying, I want to be like you, Peko. I want to be like you. So, this whole time, Peko is basically the hero of the story. But at the same time, as I said before in my intro, man, this story has a lot to do with everybody. Everybody has something to contribute towards this story. Even Sakuma came back in this episode and was trying to drop some knowledge on Kazuma. And Kazuma gave him the wrong As Kazuma gave him, it was like, I play for myself. And, and Kazuma,、um, Sakuma is calling him out of this bullshit. It's like, dude, I know you ain't play. <laughs> I know you don't play for yourself. I know you play for the team. So that's why he ended up telling、um, whatever that dude's name is. Is it Sakama? I think it's Sakama. <laughs> I think it's Sakama. Anyways, the vice captain, you know, I was like, no, you lying. <laughs> you didn't say that. But, anyways, you know, kind of call him out just not telling the truth. And I do believe that he plays for his team,、um, he cares about the team. He wants to see them succeed, and maybe he used Mr. Smile as a vice to make them want to be better because they were slacking. And he, I mean, I guess he wished everybody was on his level, I guess, but that's not the case here. So I love that ending, man. I love the fact, I, I think I missed the, 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 um, the, um, the bracket. I think I missed them showing that it was him because I thought he lost the match. That's why I was so disappointed because I thought he lost the match because the name they announced, I don't know if it's because I'm not used to、uh, um, His name is Hashino, right? Hashino, I think, I think that's his name. So I was used to that. So I was thinking it was the other guy that, that won. On the match, so my bad. I totally missed that because it didn't look like he won the match. So, because I mean, he was dead tired, he's leaning on that bad knee, which he kept saying, Oh, it's okay, it's okay. 
how is this match going to go? I really don't think that he's going to win the next match. But if he does, it's going to be one hell of a match. And I'm here for it. So let's jump into the next episode, man. I will see you guys over there for episode 10.